Namaseo, this is Ava from Glow with Ava and welcome to my channel today. In this channel, if you are new, I cover everything you have to know about skincare, beauty, facial massages, beauty gadgets, all of the above. So today we are actually going to be talking about one of the most asked questions on laugh lines. And this is a question that I've been getting so much recently and to be honest with you, it's not something that I've really paid attention to much until recently and i think with technology getting better skincare bedding better we're just paying so much more attention to our skin little details that we didn't even notice before and once i noticed that the thing about laugh lines i just can't stop looking at them now so i did a lot more research into how we can fight this um, at home or through surgical procedures so after doing all my research and doing it on myself I bring to you a video today on how you can actually treat them um, naturally at home. Before we get into anything, what exactly are laugh lines? So laugh lines are these vertical lines that start from the edge of your nose and kind of slide down and curve down to your mouth area and sometimes it will even go down to your chin as well. So the deeper the crease is right here, the more visible your laugh lines will get. And actually, laugh lines are something that is very, very natural. If you look at some of your high school photos, you'll even notice that you or your friends will have these laugh lines. They just may not be as visible, but as a natural aging process, the creases will get deeper, just how you can see more visible laugh lines. Let's talk about how laugh lines actually work. So the laugh line is right here in the creases. So what actually makes the crease deeper is if the skin right above here, think about the circle, if that sags below, then the creases will deepen. However, try this for yourself at home right now too. If you lift this circle part up, then you will see that this crease kind of disappears as well. So the main goal for a laugh lines is to be able to loosen up the muscle here and also lift this area so that it will diminish the appearance of your fine lines. But for already existing laugh lines, especially if they're more static, so there's two different kinds of laugh lines. Um, those that are more static, so if you are just sitting like this with no expression and you still see them, versus if you're kind of making expressions, laughing, all of that, then you see it. Those are something that is um, possibly easier to fix too. However, I do want to warn you that there is no skincare product out there that can completely reverse the laugh lines that you already have. So the most common way to treat the laugh lines are actually fillers, specifically hyaluronic acid fillers. By injecting a ton of hyaluronic acid, you want to flatten out the curve here. So by injecting something in here, then that naturally flattens out the curve, which is why instead of having to lift this part up, it just naturally flattens it out, making sure um, you don't really see it. However, I do warn, want to warn that if you are going for the filler route, you really have to make sure you find someone you trust, someone who knows how to do it well, because if you inject a little too much of filler, then it can actually look very unnatural as well. So with Botox, it's another route you can go as well, but I heard that Botox is not something that is too recommended because of how small this portion is. Botox is more for areas that have more areas to work with, such as like between your forehead, your eye area and such, but here is not something that apparently is too recommended. But I know there's like thousands and thousands of other surgical procedures that people do in Korea. But with those one, I heard that you either have to go in like three times in a row to get them. And even during those procedures, you can't really like laugh properly or like move your mouth too much. So it really depends on what kind of job you have, your lifestyle. Personally, I just don't think I can go through that yet. But for the time being, I've experimented with all the things that I currently have at home, including my fingers, to see how we can treat your lab lines naturally at home. And that is something that I get asked the most. So I hope you guys enjoy the next part of this video. So to treat it naturally, we also have to understand the natural causes of lab lines. Laugh lines are a very natural process of aging because as you age, the collagen production is diminished and that leads to sagging skin. So what happens when you have sagging skin? The creases get deeper. But another cause for this is, for example, weight gain or extreme weight loss. 
or habits such as smoking, drinking too much, not sleeping, stress, all of this can have a very major impact on the appearance of your fine lines. So how do you remedy it? These may seem obvious, so but I'm just gonna say it. Drink plenty of water. You wanna make sure your skin is hydrated in and out. Drink the water, make sure you're putting up plenty of hydrating ingredients on your skin at the same time make sure you're getting a ton of sleep. And I actually can't emphasize this enough because on days when I don't get enough sleep, I just immediately see the effect on my skin, how dull it looks. Um, and actually I heard from people and dermatologists that for those people who are getting filler injections, the results dramatically differ for people who have kind of really, really little sleep versus people who exercise on a daily basis and also get eight hours of sleep they see much more results from their fillers versus the other group. Now that we talked about some of the lifestyle things we can do, let's now finally talk about skincare. So what can you do without actually putting in needles in your skin? The first one that I want to mention is this New Face device. This New Face device, you guys know I love it and I talked about it in so many videos. I'll link my um, videos here down below. But this is a great device if you use it consistently to help lift and sculpt your overall face. Because by doing that, if you lift up this area, once again, you kind of lift this area to diminish the appearance of your laugh line. So this is a great device for an overall face lift. However, if you do have more static laugh lines that you want to target, then that's when you can buy another attachment that comes with a new face that is a lot more targeted from here. So you can just do your treatment, the same microcurrent kind of treatment along your laugh line. You can also do this for your crow's feet, um, your 11 lines and your frown lines, brow bones, all that good stuff. So this is definitely a lot, lot more targeted. So I think it's a great investment for those of you who really want to get a more targeted approach versus something that is a little bit more general and lifting of your entire face. So with that aside, if you still don't want to invest in a microcurrent or beauty gadgets, you can still use your lovely fingers and guasa. And I do have a lot of videos on Instagram and TikTok where I do this. I'm going to leave a little clip for you uh, right here for you to see how exactly you can do it with your fingers. Here is how to help fight your laugh lines. First, make sure you have plenty of serum or moisturizer. First, put your thumbs right here and then move it in upwards motions and keep doing this for about 30 seconds. Second, excuse the middle finger, but you use your middle finger and move it in upwards motions and apply a little bit of pressure and do this for 30 seconds. And lastly, use your hands to move in swipe up motions and do this for five times. So easy, right? So you can always come back to this clip or find me on Instagram to repeat this exercise on a daily basis. But aside from those kinds of exercises, some daily other things you can do that will actually help to um, lead to long-term improvements is just when you're sitting down, you know, just kind of do this around your nose to loosen up the muscles around here, move it up, move it up like this up and down your nose, and this will help to release some, some of the muscles around here. If you don't have any makeup, but you can also do these kinds of motions, similar to the facial massage that I had earlier. And then to kind of tighten the muscles around your mouth area, you can also do this. I know it looks funny, but this kind of exercise when you're sitting down will also help to tighten it. Another way is to do this. So the first one was, lifting it downward, this one is lifting it outwards, like that. Okay, now let's talk about some skincare products. And I said earlier, no skincare product can actually reverse the laugh lines that you already have. Nothing is going to completely eliminate it, okay? That's when Botox and fillers can come in. But there are also products that you can help to diminish the appearance of your fine lines or as more preventative measures. So some of the ingredients I always look for for that purpose in skincare is retinol, vitamin C, peptides, ceramides, and just a bunch of antioxidants to help promote the production of more collagen. And that gets into the deep cellular level. Let's first talk about retinol because I think retinol is something that is extremely powerful, especially if your skin can handle it. I personally do have very, very sensitive skin, so we can't use that many retinol products out in the market. However, this one from Natorium is 
um, they're very gentle retinol serum that has worked incredibly well for my skin. Sometimes I won't even use it for my entire face, but just focus on certain parts of my face. Another retinol oil that has been lovely is the Tata Hopta Tata Harper Retinol Oil. I've been using this. It's my second bottle already. It's so lovely and one of the best oils for you to do your own facial massages um, without kind of harming your skin or tugging at your skin because of how beautifully this applies on the skin as well. Great overnight oil. Another one that you can use overnight is this Retinol Brightening Sleeping Facial. This is a new one that I've been testing lately and it's lovely. It has a blend of AHA, BHA, and Retinol. So a very powerful exfoliating blend. And for this one, you should use three days in a row. Give a little break. So I give to five to seven days a break. And then I'll come back using this for three days in a row for maximum results. And then ceramides is also something I love in um, skincare to kind of plump up the area. This one is something that I'm loving with um, avocado in it as well. I just love how hydrating and plumping this one is. So this peptide booster from Polish Ray is something that I always have in my vanity to add a little droplet or two. So I love adding a drop or two into my serums or moisturizers. And this combo is something that I've been loving as well. So I cannot emphasize the um, importance of some, having some peptides in your skincare routine. The last one that I want to mention is this really, really bougie, um, expensive one one skin NAC Y2 serum. So this one is their um, patented proprietary technology behind it. And it was actually originally formulated for the purpose of patients dealing with trauma and to help with accelerating he um, healing. This one has their patented NAC formula that has glutathione, which actually helps to boost the effects of vitamin C and vitamin E um, and the antioxidants powers behind it. So without getting too much deep into it, this is something that can actually get into your cellular level um, and very, very effective. So on days when I'm feeling super extra, I'll go in with a little bit of this and then my new face attachment and go in slowly with that exercise. I cannot emphasize the importance of doing home care and changing your lifestyle without having to rely on some of the surgical procedures. So I hope you guys take some messages from this video and start to implement some of the more daily practices in your life, such as doing... <laughs> Well, anyways, thank you so much for watching my video today. I really appreciate it. If you guys want to see more facial massages videos like this, subscribe to my channel here below and also follow me on Instagram and TikTok at Glow with Ava. And I'll see you guys next.